Doug DeHaven here from DJD Laboratories. I'm sure a lot of you guys have had the problem wherever your truck's sitting at ride height, your tank has full pressure in it. Whenever you release some part of the tank or release tank pressure, the whole truck drops. You have to wonder if something's wrong with the valve or what's going on. Hopefully I can help explain it. Before me here I have a Dan's valve. This is a very similar pallet operated valve that a lot of you guys use on your truck. I've removed the bolts for simplicity here. Inside the valve, you have a diaphragm that's held down by air or air pressure. So in this particular valve, the air comes in this port, comes up around this outer orifice through a small hole here in the diaphragm and presses down on top. The output, this port, comes out through here on the valve. So when normal air pressure is in your tank, it's constantly pushing down on this part of the valve, keeping it sealed. Whenever you open the valve normally, a small piston inside here will lift up, transferring air from one side of the diaphragm out this small hole to the output, which relieves the head pressure. Doing so, the diaphragm lifts up, allowing air to pass from one chamber to the other and lifting your vehicle up. Now this works against you whenever your tank pressure drops. What happens is when you lose tank pressure on this side of the valve, the air is removed off the head of the valve. So you now have, let's say, 50 psi pushing up from the center of the valve on this small orifice here. Now there's nothing on top holding it, it lifts this up, forcing air back into the tank. This will even tank pressure. Normally inside the valve, you have a small spring. This keeps your diaphragm shut under normal pressure. But when your bag is sitting at probably 50 psi greater than your tank pressure, this spring can't compensate for that greater the difference. Hence the valve opens up, bleeding your tank down. I hope this helps explain how these valves operate. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know.